Wednesdays fans. It's Wednesday, but we're talking about Tuesday's episode. And I want to start off by saying um, the Bopes do not seem to be happy with me saying that uh, Nicole and Daniel are the hottest couple ever. Woo-wee! <laughs> and I don't want to mess with you Bopes. And I have a question. I was thinking about this as I lay in bed this morning because, of course, I think about days all day long. <laughs> But when I thought you thought of me all day long. Oh yeah, yeah, that too. Um, when Crystal Chappelle left the show, we lost I don't know what percentage of the Carbo fans, but people said we're leaving, we're not coming back. And I wanna know for you Bopes, do you feel that way about Peter Ruckel leaving? Are you going to stop watching the show? Because I fear if we lost all those carbos and then we lose the Bopes too. What next? Yeah, I don't know how the show's gonna exist without Peter Reckle on this. What are they going to do with What are they going to do with Hope? Well, um, some people suggest that she might end up with EJ. Like, there's actually EJ Hope websites, KDR said. I can't even imagine that. Because I thought we were going down the route that EJ and Hope might, or EJ and John might be, no. Hope and John might be EJ's parents. Hope you told me there's people out there who want EJ and Will together. I mean, what oh, next? Yeah. That's, that's, a, that's not a very clever idea. Well, don't say that because we don't want to call our people not clever. Oh, sorry. To all those no, e it's, no, Jill it's, fans out there. It's one of the people we like. Willage. <laughs> <laughs> so, seeing which, Sonny has declared that he has feelings for Will. And by will, I mean the character, not the testament you fill out to say who's going to get your crap when you die. I don't think very many yet. people out there were confused. We had some problems yesterday with JV and I, or two days ago. Okay. Speaking of 10 o'clock, or 9 o'clock tomorrow. Huh? 9 o'clock tomorrow is our appointment. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to go get our will all straightened out. So, uh, what are you doing there? Not our son will. The other one. <laughs> And um, I have to come up with a clever way to kill JB between now and then. No, I'm just kidding. Um, how do you like secret agent Nicole? Oh, yeah. She's all like, you know what, Rafe? I want to do something nice for you because of all the nice things you've done for me. And he's like, oh, yeah, and it wouldn't hurt your case any to have EJ locked away. There's Spencer and Nicole websites already. I've oh, seen God. them out there. So I don't know. When I see Rafe looking with those big brown eyes at Nicole, I'm like, oh, I kind of like them too. Oh, I would have been just as happy with them. So what and then if it's blindsided by Daniel and Nicole. And are they going to have a love triangle there? What's going on? Hmm, yeah, because Carrie's going. So I, Rafe is all alone. People think Rafe and Billy might wind up together. Yeah, she hasn't booted, been booted off the show yet. But. Yeah, but practically, we see her, what, like once a week? Do we see Billy once a week? Do we? So I have my quote of the day. I'm going to say it a little early. Okay. But when Will's like, can I ask you a question? What did you see in my mom? And then the quote of the day is, you're a smart guy. How'd you end up with her, of all people? <laughs> and, and EJ's like, oh, yeah, your mom. Like he's we even all think. make mistakes. He just flustered even trying to answer that question. I still think that's the one that he loves when we asked him at day of days. Well, you think it's Nicole? I just think Nicole will be less obvious. So are they going to get a jammy back together? Because I think Lucas is afraid to leave a jammy alone in case they end up accidentally having sex or something. You know, EJ is grieving again, and you know how he deals with grief. <laughs> Bring a condom to that one. <laughs> so, Will, when he says, nothing good can come of you visiting EJ, he means, please keep your shirt on. Although Sammy is looking very cute in that silvery I think, gray I think she's dress. got a spray tan going on. She did get a spray tan when she was on the cover of Shape magazine, or one of those magazines that Alison Sweeney was, I don't know if she was a cover, but she was in a bikini, and she got down to a size four for that shoot. Or no, was she normally a size four and she went down to a size two? I Jesus. think that's what it was. I'm like, holy mother, I could be on an IV two before I ever got to a size two. Unless, of course, you're shopping at like Ann Taylor Loft because they want you to think you're skinnier than you are. 
So yeah, that's just Gap annoying. Does that too. I it's annoying. Trying, I remember you trying on a size zero skirt. And that was when I was like bigger than I am now. Yeah, I'm not a size zero. No, no. Okay. Anywho, let's talk more about. Wait, what is this? Oh, surely it must have slipped my mind. What a crack team of parents you are. <laughs> what, what did he say that to Lucas and Sammy? Uh, it must be. Yeah. <laughs> so funny when he, they were like we're his parents <laughs> let us take care of will so will seems torn like on one hand he's like kind of loyal and protective of ej but on the other hand he wants to like screw him to the wall get his put in jail forever and find out his secrets and ej too do you have any friends right now do you have any friends no family no friends i mean any? abe's gonna become your new bff probably. for 10 families all dead <laughs> Well, he's got his two kids. That's about it. So how did Rafe know that the will had been changed? I don't know how any of them knew. Did the lawyer say it had been changed? No, no, no. The lawyer... Oh, maybe they found a copy in the house of the unsigned will. Because Ide was all like, don't tell anybody, Mr. Lawyer. And the lawyer's like, you, you, nobody will hear from me. And Rafe busts out with it like it's a no, no, public no, no, knowledge. No, 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 no. The part the lawyer's not supposed to tell is that EJ was not... Um, Stefano's son, so that it won't be contested oh, oh, that oh, way. Oh, oh, not the will being. Okay, I gotcha. So, <clears throat> I want to just say I don't know that much about the legal system, but from what I do know, if seven people have their fingerprints on the same gun, wouldn't that be reasonable doubt at each one of their um, trials? Like any single one of them that they decide to try. Well, couldn't you, they use the evidence from the other people? That couldn't be the star piece of evidence. You got to get something else. If they are, if they have seven suspects in a case and then they bring it to trial, I would think the lawyer could bring all the evidence. From, that's why I don't understand. Like, that's why it seems like when they catch someone, they want to put the first person they catch in jail. Because otherwise, if they go after someone else, the second person can use whatever interrogations they used on the first person. It's yeah. Reasonable doubt. You should apply for a job down at the station. Yeah, I think Salem. I could. I'm going to go down to Stetson Law after a week to <laughs> just recap. And if they're not completely flooded, I might, you know, take the bar or something. Justin's going to be off the show pretty soon, so you might step <laughs> in there. They need but a good female lawyer. Are they going to give Will the job of being in charge of Sammy? Because I would, I love, would love that. that. That'd be awesome. Because yeah. now that he's gay, of course he's got to work in makeup or something. Oh, I never even thought of that. <laughs> you can't be going around being a thug now. Stereotypes. <laughs> but, I mean, that would be so awesome. If, and and uh, Lucas is working there, too. And it's Aunt Billy's company. That would be kind of cute. Keep it all in the family. So, um, I don't know. I don't know what to say about this Nicole and EJ thing. She's got three freaking guys. Everybody's got more guys than they need following them. And these poor guys are just, like, starving for crumbs. I mean, <laughs> Rafe, Rafe, EJ, and Daniel all going after Nicole. And then EJ, Sammy, or EJ, Will, Rafe all after Sammy. I mean, what the heck? Rafe's one step away from putting a profile on Match.com. He's got so little prospects. How about Brady? He's going to be toast soon. Once Madison leaves, I don't know what they're going to do with him. Now, of course, we're out of the loop, but did they already write off Eric Monsoff? CocaineLove.com for Brady. <laughs> what are they doing with that? That storyline's going slow. I'd like to see some more of that. Okay, so don't... Oh, I... I um. <laughs> I have to say, when Will's tell or Lucas is telling Will not to grow up so fast, and Lucas is all like, oh, I had to, and Sammy's like, oh, I'm sorry. What, is Lucas off the hook? I mean, did he not have a part in Will's totally screwed up upbringing? I mean, God, he was an alcoholic, he was um, off with Nicole, you know, he wasn't exactly father of the year. I didn't see him, like, you know, getting a plaque at Father's Day. Thank you for all the times you took me fishing, Dad. <laughs> that was not happening. Okay, is is the last name of the main criminal family headed by Stefano Demira or Demira or De, De What is it? It's driving me crazy. Like, Lucas says Demira, but most other people say Demira. It drives me nuts. Is it Sierra? Oh, yeah, that one. Ciara they all say that differently. Or... And then uh, when they had Ari, they all said that. Didn't oh they? yeah. 
telling you what. It's just pick something. This is not. This is this is a show. You you are like. The, they should have meetings. Although maybe they're keeping it real to life with people saying names differently. But most people, once they know you for a little while, are not saying your name incorrectly all the time. My God. I'm glad, I am telling you, not that we're going to have any more kids, but if we did, I would not pick any names that could be on the edge like that. <laughs> Again, no, like Jack. That's easy. People pretty much say that. What else you got on this sheet I don't related have to the actual else. show? Um, that was related to the show. <laughs> Just kidding. You know, I have been biting my tongue about something I wanted to say unrelated to the show, but uh, I think I've, go gone, for it. Go I've for gone off it. the task too much this show. I'm already going to get yelled at, but... How many people like Nicole's cute little bangs? Oh, because you're torn whether they get bangs or not? Well, I want to grow my hair out, but it's such an ugly, nasty mess. But those are so cute. I like them, but I don't know. It, I wouldn't go for them. JB's um, anti-me cutting bangs again, just so you all know. That's all right, a little strife we're having in our marriage. some kind of a survey monkey thing about oh. bangs or not, <laughs> if you really want to get to the bottom no, of this. No, 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 no. What we do want to know is what age group are we talking to right now? What I don't... I don't necessarily want to know the day's demographic, although KDR, if you could pull that up real quick, I know you must know. <laughs> but who's watching... Us. Like, what age are you? If you do not mind saying in the comments, let me know your age. Like, I would assume most of the people watching us are, like, 30 and older. Although not KDR. She's a youngin. I think Nathan's pretty young, too. Hmm. Hannah's probably under 30. All right. I have nothing else of really any crazy interest to say about Days of Our Lives right now. I'm sorry. I'm all tapped out. So... The we'll, couple that watches days together. If we are not underwater, we will recap again tonight. That's right. <laughs> okay. What about the uh, <laughs> the, the second part? Days of the month? together.